Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to do a little bit of a different kind of video for you guys um, and that is going to be an unboxing video because I just picked up this phone. It is the iPhone 7 32 gig in rose gold. I have watched thousands of these videos and I find them super interesting um, to watch. So if you are interested in this unboxing video, give me a thumbs up, um, subscribe, do all that fun stuff and let's just get on right to the video. Alrighty, so iPhone 7, rose gold, like I said. Let's just go ahead and open it, I guess. And I've watched so many of these, I know that there's a little tab, so I won't go crazy on the plastic. So just close the pull. Perfect. So there's the box. Designed by Apple in California. So in here, it just looks like some stickers, basic stuff, a SIM SIM card opener or whatever they're called. I need that. This is fun. <laughs> There's the phone. I got the white um, rose gold like I mentioned. I went from having a space gray six, um, which I liked, but I find I always go back and forth. If I have the black, I'll get the white. If I have the white, I'll get the black. So there it is. I'll take off the plastic. Ooh. That's fun. Nice, it looks good. It's, oh, okay. So this is not a button. Um, I've kind of felt this once before in the store and still I'm confused on how you're supposed to navigate through your phone. That's what it looks like. Really pretty. I'm not a huge girly person, but I find myself really drawn to this color. So I figured I'd get it for this time. So let's compare, I guess, to the six. Size-wise, I guess I'll flip it towards you. Size-wise, pretty much the same um, thickness, like exactly the same, I'd say. But I kind of feel like the iPhone 7 has a little more weight to it than the, set, the 6 does. And then obviously the back, the camera is different and then those lines are MIA for this phone. Nice, feels good. Oh yeah, and obviously the volume jack is gone. So let's turn it on. Actually, before we turn it on, what comes in the box, pretty basic for anyone who's owned an iPhone before. We have that little square for charging. We have the headphones. So the difference about the headphones, it comes with that little, I can't remember what it's called. Everyone has been saying it, I don't know. Hmm? Lightning port, I guess, yeah. So that is for all your other headphones that don't come with the adapter, but I think these ones, these headphones actually do come ready to go. Yeah, they do. So I'll keep these handy just in case I lose this or whatever because I feel like this is gonna go missing pretty quick so that is cool and then we have the charger which you can never have enough chargers so that's great that's the box so I guess turn on the phone Ta -da! I'm so excited about this, like it's so girly and beautiful. So while it starts starting up, I have to actually back up my current phone and just get some pictures off of it. Um, I had the 16 gig iPhone 6, which I regretted almost immediately because you get that pop-up message, oh, like you've run out of space. So don't recommend the size to anybody and I'm thankful that they just stopped making them all together. Um, I know the 32 gig will be perfect for me. That's actually the same size iPhone 5 that I had and that fit everything and I had loads of videos and pictures and stuff like that. Um, so the case that I got, my original case was this Sonics case. I love this case, it's gorgeous and it has actually pretty good protection. Um, iWorld had Sonics cases and they have this pineapple case so I thought I'd pick this up for this phone. Plus there's some pink in the pineapple and you'll be able to see the background which is what I wanted. So I'm really excited to get this on and see what it looks like. Oh my god, it's weird. Yeah, so this button is not a button. Instead of like pressing here, it's almost like the whole bottom half of it will press down and it's weird. For sure. Okay, so I'm gonna set this up, but basically this is an unboxing video. Um, 
Like I said, I'm not an expert, so I'm just going quickly over what is in the box, what it looks like. Initial reaction, I think this looks really, really nice. Um, I'm excited to use it to see if there's any huge differences. I know the camera has improved, um, but overall, I'm just really thankful and happy I got this phone, and I hope you enjoy this video. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Like I said, I love watching these videos, and I'm excited to actually get into this phone and use it. Um, I'll probably update you guys in my vlog or something, just how I think overall of the phone, if I think it's worth it, um, the difference between the 6. Like, I mean, I didn't have the 6S, so I feel like it is going to be a decent upgrade, but we'll see. I'll let you know. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up, um, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I'll see you in my next video.